this is the letter I received yesterday, and I had to sign for the letter at the local postal office. I had to go pick it up. It's the letter I received from the local Novomesto police station. Just like this. This is what it looks like. According to MK Ultra, brainwash, and not necessary is the case, but it was Mr. Chernila, Mr. Chernila, who would send me a letter just day, maximum two days before the hearing I would have. Uh, it would be, actually, excuse me, no, 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 no. It's actually, it would be according to scenario, and I picked one up, this letter, yesterday, okay? Uh, today is August the 20th, 2024, so yesterday it was August 19, 2024. So, according to MK Ultra, it would be a today that I would get mediation, uh, invitation to the police station Novo Mesto or it would be uh, tomorrow therefore on a Wednesday uh, day or two after uh, is when I would get invitation according to MK Ultra scenario in fact right after I didn't get one today for one thing I have to say I didn't get one today but according to the MK Ultra brainwash Therefore, it would be tomorrow that I would get a second letter. That's well, the first complaint I filed in respect to MK Ultra that I would have to go and uh, well, obviously pick one up from the postal office, uh, whatever, so that I would appear at the hearing, at the mediation, whatever at Anolo Mesto Police Station. Uh, exactly right after is Tanya Fayon stated from Social Democrats, from Milan Kuchan, from Borut Pahor, she stated, right after I return from the vacation is where your case is going to start. So now uh, 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 Slovenian counts uh, Conte, Grofi, in Grofice, uh, they had their vacation. Just as I have explained last year, it's going to be like that. It didn't happen last year, and so it's happening this year. And now they have enough time to actually work. So now we're going to start with that so you can imagine what kind of swinery this is so first we're going to open the letter and see what is this all about is this really from mr chernila as he stated it would be or is something else uh, in fact this is just something that i would have to sign actually uh, let me see this stuff here. I'm not sure. Yeah, it is. It's okay. All right, we can do that. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to do it like this. And then I'm going to make sure that I don't expose some kind of something that would be... Well, I don't like giving a phone number. And that's exactly what they told me is going to be the case that I should be hiding this stuff here. No, I'm not going to hide this here because this is for the, this is a public trial. What I at least deserve is for the people to see exactly what happened in this case. So, I don't have any kind of, uh, this is actually from Stefanich. It was not from Mr. Chernila, and that's probably because I stopped by the other day. I, I shouldn't even say this stuff, but this is already something that is not according to MKO or brainwash. 
what I stated is exactly the way it's supposed to be. It didn't happen. All right, so uh, this is, I don't know what this is, but it's a Vmesni Odgovor. I don't know how to translate this. I don't know what is the Vmesni Odgovor. The answer is answer, or there is no fucking answer. So what is the answer in between? I have no idea. Um, yeah, well, they, 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 they mentioned my uh, submitting a complaint on July 19, 2024, uh, related to the work of the police officer at the Novo Mesto Police Station. Yeah, they, um, they are saying that due to circumstances, Objectivno, objectivno means, um, it's actually this police officer here is nice police officer, it's not a bad police officer, uh, he was really trying to help, but the thing is that he was ran over and he just had to become part of this, uh, not a good, I don't have a good opinion about the police, novel master police. Um, he had to comply, basically. Okay, this is Mr. Stefanich, Andrei Stefanich, who wrote me a letter. So this is not from Mr. Chernila, who is, by the way, his assistant. Um, basically, Objectivno koalitione, this is basically about the circumstances which he rated as <laughs> realistic, all right? In the best explanation, translation, you would, you would say this is realistic. Realistic or basically something that is, that is confirmed to be legitimate, all right? Circumstances will won't be capable to uh provide you with a legal procedure on time according to the uh to the law from whatever 150 um you know besides the law here where the law is located and that kind of stuff so he's informing me that they will postpone basically this stuff Honestly, uh, when it comes to this stuff here, um, this guy was nice. Uh, he had bad things also involved in it, but he had to comply. He even had to comply with Mr. Chernila because Mr. Chernila did a lot of, quite a lot of bad stuff before 2014 decision how he's going to come to rescue here to Novo Mesto. Uh, and so he had to go to his level, uh, something that I stopped at the police station and he would not even allow me to explain the whole thing. But this is what this stuff is. So I will get another invitation, obviously, and that's all there is to it. There is nothing else going on here. And yeah, I had to go and sign this uh, at the postal office, but I was hoping it's going to be something else, but uh, here's the thing. The law provides for this stuff, and um, they, they have to do this by the law. This is a very, very bad circumstance for me, uh, to put it plain and simple, and I will not wait uh, for this stuff here. I will start my own legal proceedings against Novo Mesto Police through other institutions which were involved also European institutions, FBI and stuff like that. Uh, it's, I don't have this luxury. The truth is I don't even know if I'm going to survive this stuff. And so to put it plain and simple, yeah, no, this is, this is actually 
true. What I'm saying is it's not good with me here. It's it's um I I do have it here nasty stuff right here and this stuff paralyzes entire entire area now, I am already with a pain that became totally unbearable over the course of the time but with a pain for well, six months now uh, it's the whole thing that is affected it's really really bad uh, I did manage to ease the symptoms of what they claim me is just an infection on the other most of the time they claim me it's a cancer but on other circumstances they claim me is just an infection by simply wrapping myself cloth around my neck when I go sleep and but this matches completely the symptoms of the cancer basically because the only thing that happens is everything under me and I'm talking about my back is just like it turns into a puddle of water so uh, the thing about me is that I don't have necessary time for this to wait for these people they are in no hurry and they cause this stuff they this stuff would be I would even survive this stuff but they know about this stuff Mr. Stefani was giving me a science to mention this stuff he was the one who even went and inspect what the people look like uh, after they undergo the surgeries and he told me this is not pretty it's it looks it looks really nasty with this kind of surgery with the remove this stuff he said this is horrible stuff he insisted to me uh, it's not aesthetic and stuff like that um, yeah uh, if there will be somebody else instead of him it would have been the same thing uh, he he alone was warning me about these things uh, that this is just if I see something like this that they are postponing and doing the stuff like that to just move on and just get going in, with some other institution uh, seek assistance in other instances so that's all there is for this letter yeah, it's a good stuff. I mentioned a few interesting facts.